Hi all, I am Dr. Pradesh. Today we will be talking about cervical spondylosis. Many of us may be having this chronic neck pain which may be due to cervical spondylosis. So what is it? It is actually a degenerative condition. Uh, people with advanced age uh, will be having degenerative process going on in their cervical vertebra or the disc that is in, situated in between this uh, vertebrae and will be having this chronic pain symptoms. Uh, young patients also, especially who are engaged in activities with weighting lift, they also may be having this chronic neck pain. As the severity of the disease advances, uh, the people may also have that uh, pain radiating to upper limbs. So today we will be uh, discussing some simple remedies which may be useful in this condition. So first point is uh, some simple exercises like uh, physiotherapy. Uh, we will be discussing some isometric exercises that is uh, we will be applying pressure uh, on the side of head or face uh, with our hands. At the same time we will be uh, applying some pressure with the head in the opposite direction like this. With hand we will be applying pressure like this and uh, with the head we will be moving in the opposite direction. So actually uh, the position of the head and neck will not be changing only that uh, pressure is applied. So we will be applying uh, this technique in all six directions that is uh, we will see one by one. Uh, so as a first step we will be applying pressure on the back of head and we will be applying pressure with the head in the opposite direction. So we will do 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and relax. So next step will be in the opposite direction. We will be applying pressure on the uh, forehead and we will be giving pressure with the head in the opposite direction. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and relax. Then next will be on the side of the head. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and relax. Then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and relax. Then we will be uh, turning the face in each direction like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and relax. Then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and relax. So we see that in each step we will not be actually uh, actually we will not be moving our head just applying the pressure only this exercise that we have mentioned uh, we can do three or four times per day we may we can do it at our home or at our uh, work sites uh, whenever uh, we may we may feel pain uh, we may take a break uh, and we may do this exercise we may get some relief in the pain, especially when we are sitting in same posture for prolonged time. We may do these exercises. One more point that we should be careful is that we should not apply undue pressure while doing this uh, exercise. That uh, that is, we may be having uh, have pain while doing this exercise, so we have to stop then. And we may gradually increase the strength of the exercise day by day. And one more uh, thing that we can use for this condition is uh, one soft cervical collar. I have added one link for purchasing that sort of cervical collar. Uh, we have to select according to our size. And we should be removing that collar when we are lying down or sleeping. Some other things that uh, we can do uh, in this condition is that we should avoid um, lifting heavy weights or uh, we have to uh, avoid unwanted travel like that some jerky travel that we may have while riding in an auto rickshaw or two wheeler uh, that we have to avoid. And uh, one more thing is uh, when we lie down or sleep we have to avoid uh, heavy pillows we may try to lie flat on the bed so 
these are the uh, things i want to uh, tell you about this condition today we may uh, see you again in next video